Hi, this is Craig Valentine, author of The Perfect Day Formula, and today we're going to talk about the three things that very successful people do before breakfast. Now, you've probably read articles online about the 14 things that successful people do before breakfast, and they don't do 14 things. They don't do a five-hour routine before breakfast. It's ridiculous. But most successful people, most very successful people, do three simple things before they start their day to get on track and get ahead and have a big victory that the world can't take away from them no matter how crazy busy the rest of the day gets. So the first thing that they do is they empty their subconscious mind. And really successful people believe in the power of the subconscious mind. They believe that their brain is working overnight and coming up with great ideas. And so in the morning, they sit down and they just do a brain dump in the morning. They journal, they write, they do some gratitude work perhaps. Other people do spiritual work, but they get that time to really get the ideas in their head out and to reflect on them. So it's a combination of emptying the subconscious mind and doing some self-reflection. And that way you identify opportunities to take advantage of improving yourself and opportunities to take advantage of in improving your performance at work and in your, in your health and in your career. So it's that combination of that emptying of the subconscious mind and the self-reflection that shows us exactly what to focus on, what opportunities to go after, how to improve both our personal and professional lives. And we need to get those ideas out of our head, down on paper, so that we can really get dialed in with the day. The second thing to do is to have a fixation routine. Now you're probably wondering, what the heck is a fixation routine? What do I want to be fixated on first thing in the morning? Well, the answer is a fixation routine centers your mind for the day. It really gets you focused. And so whether you get up and you pray, or whether you get up and you exercise, or whether you get up and just have a nice cup of coffee and just stand there and reflect, that is your fixation routine. For example, Ivanka Trump, very famous entrepreneur, obviously the daughter of the president, she gets up and she listens to a TED Talk, a TED Talk that puts positive things in her mind. She also does meditation to calm down and to clear her mind. But those couple of things get her fixated to dominate the rest of the days. Now, I know that we've talked a lot in the past about what time to get up. And it doesn't matter about the hour that you get up, what matters is what you do with the hours that you are up. And it really helps when you're fixated and focused and clear about what you're gonna do for the rest of the day. So the third thing that people do after they have emptied their subconscious mind and spent a bit of time in self-reflection, and after they have fixated themselves for the rest of the day and really got their mind centered, is they focus on their number one priority for just 15 minutes, or at least 15 minutes. If you can do longer, by all means, go for it. Like I'm able to write for 60 minutes first thing in the morning. But if you can just give me 15 minutes, 15 minutes, six days a week, that's 72 hours in a year of clear thinking. And if we do this first thing in the morning before anyone else gets up, before the hurricane of the world hits us, then we're gonna have big progress. Whether we're focusing on our health or our wealth or our personal relationships, but just go down to your kitchen table, pen and paper, no electronics, no distractions, sit there and think about how you can take advantage of the number one opportunity in your life, how you can fix the number one problem in your life. Just focus on that number one priority for at least 15 minutes and you'll have a big victory that the world can't take away from you no matter how crazy it gets at work, no matter if the kids get sick, but you have that in place. So you've had three victories already before breakfast. And it doesn't take a lot of time. It doesn't require you to get up at 5 a.m. It just requires you to get up probably about 30 minutes before anybody else gets up. And you go and you empty your subconscious mind. You have a little bit of self-reflection on that. Then you get fixated and centered with the day with a small little ritual. And then you get into your number one priority for 15 minutes, you focus on that, and that is how you succeed. You know, for me personally, what I do is I get up, go downstairs, I pet my dog, I make a greens drink, and then I sit down and I write for 60 minutes. That's how I get focused. That's how I get all the information out of my subconscious mind and take advantage of working on my number one priority first thing in the morning, all wrapped up into one simple routine. And that's what I do before breakfast, and those are the three things that very successful people do before breakfast every day in order to get so far ahead in life. So model what works, 
Find the rituals and routines that allow you to be focused, centered, and to dominate your days. I'm Craig Ballantyne, author of The Perfect Day Formula, and for more rituals and routines of very, very successful people, please visit our website, earlytorise.com, and read all of the great free articles on our website.